Hey, what is going on pros and presses? Mr. Lyman HD here, and welcome to another drinks review. Today, we're reviewing Pepsi, going to be on the lime version, or the real lime version. So, uh, yeah, Mr. Lyman HD reviewing real lime Pepsi. Ha ha, how funny. So, <laughs> so I got to pick a drink out of uh, the market, actually. Um, so, Giz was selling, he had like a load of American drinks, and he had, them, he had them for 50p each, which is actually a very good price. And before you ask, yes, they are actually all still in day, because I checked. Uh, this goes out of date on the 12th, uh, 2019, and I'm recording this in August, so it's still got a good, you know, four, four, you know, four months, four or five months or so, uh, four or three months, whatever you want to call it. So, yeah, still in date, so I thought, why not, 50p, drink it and review it. So, I give you guys a 4360 of the, <clears throat> oh, excuse me, so I give you guys a 4360 of the can. So we have a, of course, so this isn't a English Pepsi, by the way, this is, of course, American, because we have nutritional facts, rather than nutritional information here we have some two languages on here though uh, but yeah the front does look cool we also have a, I just again I like the green we have a nice little slice of uh, uh, lime there real lime and we have the green band around the top on the bottom everything is silver and standard including the top which is all standard and silver as well I don't know if you can hear that that's really loud so this is of course the usual 355 milliliter can which you're used to uh, sugar is Again, it's, it's differently how they're doing it. They've got it per 355 mil, so it's not per 100 mil. And it says on here 25 grams, which I'm actually surprised by. That's actually quite low for full sugar Pepsi. Uh, that's actually, and for the fact it's American, that's actually quite low. Uh, yeah, 25 grams per 350, 355 mil, that is quite low. Uh, caffeine content is 38 milligrams uh in this entire can, so that's uh, that, that is low because generally it's 32 milligrams per 100 mil in energy drinks. I know it's not an energy drink, just for comparison. Um, so yeah, that's, that's literally like you know way less than what an energy drink has. So it's pretty much nothing. Apart from that, uh, the writing's quite blurry. Actually, I don't know if you can really see on the uh, camera, but the writing's quite uh, blurry. You can just about read it. Uh, yeah, this is uh, PepsiCo oh, Canada. So I say it says on the Canada Miss Miss. Uh, Return for refund where applicable. Yeah, okay. Return of poor when present to allow or applicable. I don't know if that's Spanish or French or something. I'm really not too sure. But anyways, guys, it's nice and cold. I've got a cup. Let's get straight to it. Hopefully it doesn't explode over me. Travelling lots of miles to get here in my room. So, Pepsi Lime. Of course, we all know that Coke used to do Coke Lime. And, of course, you've got the fake, you know, cheap supermarket equivalent uh, lime and lemon ones they kind of do, but we're not interested in them. So I wonder how it stacks up to the Coke lime, which, to be honest, I haven't done for years. They used to do the, the old lime back in the day and the old uh, lemon in the cans. I don't know if you guys remember that, the old diet lemon and uh, diet uh, lime as well. And they're actually all right, you know, for its time. So uh, bear in mind, this is full sugar, although it's not American full sugar. So we'll find out. There is one more ingredient, though. Uh, I know Coke use high fructose corn syrup. Man, this is so blurry. I can glucose fructose and or sugar concentrate lime juice. Uh, yeah, I don't think it contains high fructose corn syrup, but yeah, you know. Right. As always with Coke and Pepsi, the fizziest drinks on the planet. Well, it's nice to see it hasn't lost its carbonation traveling through the uh, air or sea. I don't know if it got over it. There we go. So, of course, you've got the usual color of Coke and Pepsi, which is the color of death, which is just brown and, you know, just dark brown and black. Uh, you can't really see through it. You can't really see through with, these, uh, with this liquid. Uh, the smell. Smells fairly strong of limes, I will give it that. Smells smells quite nice. You know, I do like Coke and I do like I don't mind Pepsi, you know, like Pepsi Max on its own. Generally you know, if I drink Pepsi, it's generally uh you know Pepsi Max Raspberry or you know uh, um, yeah the raspberry or something. So it actually smells nice. Nevertheless guys, let's uh, taste some. Mmm. That's lovely. That is lovely. Re really fizzy, as they always are. Oh. 
that is well nice guys it's nice and cold you know it's a bit warm outside it's nice and cold you know what that is definitely different to your usual american soda drinks because that is no way as syrupy and as sickly as the american fantas are and you know the american uh cokes and stuff if anyone i'm sure a lot of you have tried a can of american fanta at some point you know whatever flavor maybe berry apple pineapple whatever their american fantas are like one of the most syrupy and sugary drinks you'll ever drink in your life i'm sure I so said, I'm sure you've had a can at some point in your life or a friend or relatives has. And we all know how ridiculously sweet they are. This is nowhere near like that. Even with the reduced sugar, I mean, it's not technically reduced. It's just got less sugar than the, again, the full sugar. I'm just, you know, based on what this is. So I'll just call it reduced sugar just for the sake of the video. So even though it's got reduced sugar, it's, it's, it's the perfect sweetness. Like, I mean, I personally only drink Coke Zero and, you know, Pepsi Max if I do drink Coke and Pepsi, I never touch the full sugar stuff. I think, personally, I think full sugar Coke tastes just, just disgusting. Like, I hate it. It's just horrible. I'm, I'm so used to zero and zero and all that. So, um, but this, you know, as a full as a full sugar, reduced sugar Pepsi, you know, because the full sugar Pepsi, I guess, contains more than that. Like, full sugar Coke does. It still contains 10 grams per 100 mil. So, it would be more than that. Um, so, as a full sugar, reduced sugar Pepsi product, American, the sweetness is just right. Like it's got just that little bit of sweetness there, which we know which people people would prefer rather than it being completely you know not sweet at all, or have any sweetness, or to be you know full sugar. So it's just got that little bit of sweetness to it, which is lovely. And then the lime flavour, it's really nice. And yeah, it literally does taste like there is real lime juice in there. It doesn't taste you know because sometimes you know sometimes some of the fizzy lemon drinks you drink they taste like you know artificial lemon and they you know they taste like like toilet clean lemon or the you know the freaking air freshener lemons. it's got that really artificial lemon scent like the toilet blocks you know or whatever you know smell them in the toilets like they used to kind of taste like that but this no it actually tastes of nice real lemon it's almost like you've literally got normal pepsi and they've literally like squeezed lime juice into that um which they probably have done um not not literally squeezed it in but you know you get the point um but as that is, that's no, really nice, guys. I really like that. Mm. That's nice. I wish I'd bring back lime and lemon stuff. I mean, they keep doing these weird flavours now, as you guys are aware of Coke, you know, exotic mango and peach and twisted strawberry and, and uh, you know, all these, you know, raspberry now and, uh, uh, and just loads of others they're doing. I wish they'd, uh, I wish they'd bring them back. I know that they are rotating their kind of, you know, usual stuff, but... You know, anyway, as as this is, this is nice. I absolutely love that. Um, and again, I'm glad that is just about just 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 the amount out, just the of the right amount of sugar. That makes sense. Mm. That's lovely, guys. You know what? Do I give that a double thumbs up? <sighs> I won't give it a double thumbs up because it has sugar, which means as a daily drinker, I wouldn't drink it purely for that reason, unfortunately. Um, but nevertheless, it all gets a decent thumbs up for me for what it is. Um, so yeah, that's lovely, guys. If you see it, <laughs> I doubt you will, but pick it up and try it. So as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all later.